Joe, I spoke to Fawaz Georges, the director of Middle East Centre at the London School of Economics. He told us the firing is a game changer. You know, there has been a fierce struggle between, I mean, the Muslim Brotherhood, in particular now the presidency and the military as an institution. And Mohamed Morsi, as the new president of Egypt, has been trying to reassert the authority of the presidency, trying to challenge the military monopoly on power. He fired just yesterday, as you know, in the last uh, 48 hours, the head of the intelligence services. And now to fire Tantawi and Sami Anan, he is also trying to say that the president basically is the supreme uh, uh, commander in chief, the executive, and we shall see what the military will do, the military as an institution. And, and, and that's why, will the military basically sacrifice Tantawi and Sami Anan? The reason why uh, Mursi basically sacked Tantawi and Sami Anan, they are the two most powerful, and they are the drivers behind SCAF, and of course, Tantawi is the defense minister. We shall see how far the authority of the president will go. We shall see how far the military will go in its basically challenge of the presidency. But the reality is this is the beginning of a major ferocious battle for influence and authority between the presidency and the military. And whoever wins this particular battle, this particular struggle, will basically determine the nature of the political transition in Egypt in the next few months and next two years ahead.